shall we do with a drunken sailor? What shall we do with a drunken sailor? What shall we do with a drunken sailor early in the morning? Way up she rises, way up she rises, way up she rises early in the morning. So if you didn't have me for music last year, you may not have ever heard this song. So this is a really fun song that when we're talking about way up she rises, the she is the boat and it's rising because the waves are, are rising and falling. So when it's, what shall we do with the drunken sailor? What shall we do with the drunken sailor? What shall we do with the drunken sailor? Early in the morning, way up she rises, way up she rises, way up she rises, early in the morning. Now, let's put the rhythm on the board, the green screen that is, and see if we can do the rhythm syllable. What makes a wildcat wild, boys? What makes a wildcat wild? What makes a wildcat wild, boys? What makes a wildcat wild? I'll tell you again as a personal friend. What makes a wildcat wild? Jumping makes a wildcat wild, boys. Jumping makes a wildcat wild. Jumping makes a wildcat wild, boys. Jumping makes a wildcat wild. I'll tell you again as a personal friend. What makes a wildcat wild? Skipping makes a wildcat wild, boys. Skipping makes a wildcat wild. Skipping makes a wildcat wild, boys. Skipping makes a wildcat wild. I'll tell you again as a personal friend. What makes a wildcat wild? Okay, it's your turn. I'm not going to do this. Crawling makes a wildcat wild, boys. Crawling makes a wildcat wild. Crawling makes a wildcat wild, boys. Crawling makes a wildcat wild. I'll tell you again as a personal friend, what makes a wildcat wild? Okay, if you can think of a good thing, it's a motion that makes a wildcat wild, submit it to me in Schoology and I'll use your suggestion next week. Now, last week, well, that wouldn't be last week. That would actually probably be yesterday. It's weird to get used to that. You watched my friend Angie. She's from another school, and she sang a song called The Farmer's Dairy Heat, which I taught you last year. But she had a really cute video, so I wanted you to see her version. I lost the farmer's dairy key. I'm in some lady's garden. Do, do, let me out. I'm in some lady's garden, garden. I lost the farmer's dairy key, I'm in some lady's garden. Do, do, let me out, I'm in some lady's garden, garden. I lost the farmer's dairy key, I'm in some lady's garden. Do, do, let me out, I'm in some lady's garden, garden, garden. Keep going, please. Cape Cod girls, they have no cones, heave away, heave away. They comb their hair with codfish bones. We are bound for Australia. Heave away, my bully bully boys. Heave away, heave away. Heave away, and don't you make a noise. We are bound for Australia. Cape Cod boat girls, they have no sleds. Heave away, heave away. They slide down hills on codfish heads. We are bound for Australia. Heave away, my bully bully boys. Heave away, heave away. Noise. We are bound for Australia, bound for Australia, bound for Australia. Keep going, bound for Australia. One more, bound for Australia. Old Mr. Rabbit, you've got a mighty habit of jumping in my garden and eating all my cabbage. Let's sing it again. Do what I do, so we're going to clap and pat. Here we go. Old Mr. Rabbit, you've got a mighty habit of jumping in my garden and eating all my carrots. Let's sing the first.
first two phrases of the song and put my ostinato with it. My ostinato is this. Here we go. Old Mr. Rabbit, you've got a mighty habit. <gasps> On which beat do we clap in the first phrase? Let's sing it again. Here we go. Old Mr. Rabbit. If you said the first beat, you are correct. Now let's sing the first two phrases of this song. Here we go, old Mr. Rabbit, you've got a mighty habit. <sighs> Which word do we clap on in the second phrase? If you said got, you are correct. So in the first phrase we clap on old, and on the second phrase we clap on got. Let's sing it again. Here we go, old Mr. Rabbit, you've got a mighty habit of jumping in my garden. Which word do we clap on in the third phrase? Yes, we clap on jumping, jumping. Okay, we're going to sing the whole song. Here we go, old Mr. Rabbit. Now I bet you already know that in the fourth phrase we clap on the word eating. So we have old on the first phrase, got on the second phrase, jumping on the third phrase, and eating on the fourth phrase. So do those words fall on the strong part of the beat or on the weak part of the beat? Yes, they fall on the strong part of the beat. 